Hello everyone. Hope you all doing well and welcome back to our Windows Server 2022 beginners video series on MSFT webcast. In this video, we will see the steps on how to block a specific GPO from inheritance on an OU. Grip policy enforcement, inheritance and block inheritance provide administrators with the necessary flexibility allowing the successful group policy deployment within Active Directory, especially in large organizations where multiple GPUs are applied at different levels within the Active Directory, causing some GPUs to accidentally override others. GPUs are applied according to the group policy hierarchy in the following order. Local GPO GPUs linked to the site GPUs linked to the domain, GPUs linked to the OUs. By default, an Active Directory container inherits settings from GPUs that are applied at the next higher level in the hierarchy. Blocking inheritance prevents the settings in GPUs that are linked to higher level sites, domains or OUs from being automatically inherited by the specified domain or OU unless the link for a GPO is enforced. To block inheritance of group policy from parent Active Directory containers, you can specify the block inheritance option. For example, if you specify the block inheritance option for an OU, it prevents the application of policy at the level from higher level OU or domain. For this demo, we have single domain Active Directory forest name msftwebcast.com. This is our Windows Server 2022 domain controller for msftwebcast.com domain. Log on to our Windows Server 2022 domain controller using a domain administrator account. From the Server Manager's tool menu, select Group Policy Management. In this example, we have an OU named HR. We have linked a GPO named HR Baseline GPO to our OU. Under HR OU, we have another child OU named HR Users. We can confirm Map Network Drive GPO is linked to our OU HR Users. Go to Group Policy Inheritance tab. As we can see, the default domain policy GPO with precedence 3 will be processed first because the default domain policy is applied at the domain level, whereas the other two GPOs applied at the OU level. The HR baseline GPO with precedence 2 will be processed second because it is applied at the parent OU level. Let's go to Windows 10 client computer. Sign into this computer using the Deepak Patel's user account. Remember, Deepak Patel's user account is stored under HR Users OU. Open File Explorer. We can see the map drive. This means the GPU link to HR Users OU is applying successfully. Open Run Menu. Type Control and hit Enter key to open Control Panel. We will receive an error as access to Control Panel is restricted due to the HR Baseline GPU. This means the GPU linked with Azure OU is also applying successfully. As GPUs can be inherited by default, they can also be blocked if required using the block inheritance option. If the block inheritance setting is enabled, the inheritance of group policy setting is blocked. Let's block GPU inheritance. Go back to our domain controller. To configure blocking of GPU inheritance, Right-click the OU container and select the Block Inheritance option. In our case, right-click the HR Users OU and select Block Inheritance option. We have new symbol on HR Users OU, which represents that we have Block Inheritance of Group Policy at HR Users OU level. On Group Policy Inheritance step, as we can see, we no longer have the default domain policy GPO or HR baseline GPO due to the block inheritance. We have successfully blocked the GPO inheritance. To see the result, let's go to Windows 10 Client Computer. Open Run Menu, type CMD and hit Enter key. At Command Prompt, 
टाइप कमांड जी पी अपडेट स्लैश फोर्स एंड हिट एंटर की to update the group policy settings we can confirm that we have updated the group policy settings on this computer uh, let me close command prompt and file explorer let's again open file explorer we can see the map drive this means the gpo link with hr users ou is still applying open run menu type control and hit enter key to open control panel and this time we can access control panel as hr baseline gpo is not applying on this computer due to the group policy block inheritance we can also use rsop.msc to check the group policy assignment right click on user configuration and select properties we can see only gpo which is currently applying is map network drive gpo let me select these check boxes we can see the hr baseline gpo and under filtering we can see it is blocked same for our default domain policy as well so this way we can block inheritance of group policy in windows server 2022 active directory there is one more option name enforce and enforce gpo overrides inheritance blocking be aware that the enforce option always takes precedence over the block inheritance option enforcement prevent a lower level policy from overriding a superseding policy from a parent site domain or ou in the next video we will take a look at gpo enforcement using the same setup that's all for this video on how to block inheritance of group policy in windows server 2022 active directory i hope you found this video helpful If you have any questions and suggestions regarding this video please let me know in the comment section Thank you all for watching this video have a nice day